Today I'm going to show you guys the most game-changing AI effect that will allow you to create any 3D scenes for your music videos for free. If you guys are new to the channel, my name is Jacob and I run the Tiny Tape shop where we sell editing plugins, presets, and a bunch of other stuff on our website. So if you're interested in leveling up your videos, make sure you go check that out down below. So jumping right into the video, if you guys haven't seen this brand new Young Faiso All in Motion video, first of all, it's crazy, you gotta go watch it. And second of all, I gotta shout out the director, Sage Wolf. He is an absolute legend and did an amazing job in this video and honestly completely changed the game with this one because he introduced introduced a new kind of effect that you can do with AI that I think a lot of people are going to start doing and I'm going to show you guys how you can do it today. So essentially what he did in this video is all of these scenes like you see this here, this scene right here, these are all fake and created with AI. And the first time I watched this video, I watched it in full screen in 4K and I actually thought that they created and shot this video in Japan. I had no idea. Japan, Korea, China, it was giving that vibe. So I'm going to go ahead and play for you guys. So all these shots, this is obviously, this is fake, fake. All this is AI. This is real, obviously, AI. And it completely blew my mind. If you guys are familiar with this video, you already know what I'm talking about. So I'm gonna be showing you guys how you can create these crazy 3D B-roll animations, etc., for your videos, like these crazy flying through the air shots, all this, like this is all insane. Let's hop right into it. Now I'm gonna show up my boy Tanner. He put me onto his Sora account and also told me about this method as well and how to do it. And then make sure you guys go follow Sage Wolf as well. He's the goat. He made that young phase of video. Now, starting off, what we wanna do is we wanna go inside a chat GPT, and essentially the workflow here is we wanna be telling Sora, which is an AI uh, video generation. You guys can see I created these ones here. Like, look how insane that looks. Like a 3D VFX artist could have made this. And if you put a little bit of grain on it, it plays, you speed it up. You can't really tell that it's AI. And I'll show you guys a bunch of other examples here. So you have these ones, you have these ones. And then Tanner, who I showed it up before, made these for a music video that we're currently working on right now. Like you guys can see how nuts. Sometimes it doesn't match the card perfectly, but this is just so insane that this is AI creating this. Um, it's a great way to get more B-roll for your music videos. So essentially, if we click on it here, let's see if it'll show me the full prompt. Uh, yeah, so this is the full prompt here. And essentially, Essentially, the workflow you want to do for this is I did not write this full prompt. You want to start off inside of ChatGPT here and you want to say, um, let's say we want to create a scene of, we'll do something from the Young phase of video. We'll be like, create me a, a drone shot flying through downtown Tokyo with bright neon lights. We'll say like at nighttime. Okay, then we'll say, take this prompt for Sora and make it extremely detailed we'll say that we'll see what it makes here so a cinematic 4k aerial drone shot flying smoothly through the buildings busting streets of downtown tokyo at night the camera glides the street above street level alleyways and wide suburban roads so we'll try this i kind of want it higher uh we'll say like make it higher around skyscrapers and then come down to the streets and you guys can see this is just absolutely nuts here we get such an in-depth description so i'm gonna pause this i'm gonna copy all this and we're gonna go into sora now and i'm gonna go to the very bottom describe our video paste this massive description in here make sure we're in 720p um five seconds and then we'll do two variations you can either choose between one video or two videos we want to and we'll hit enter and now it's going to take quite a bit but it's going to generate us a super crazy video. So I'm just going to continue to scroll down here and show you guys what Tanner created inside the account. These are all AI, for example. So let's say you have a red charger for your video and you didn't get B-roll of the car doing this. Like you could literally just create this and put this in the video. And the average viewer would actually have no idea. You have these explosions if you're shooting in a snow field just like this. And you guys could see the crazy description that he got here from ChatGPT. This one's probably one of my favorite ones. So you have a really cool POV of someone with a gun and this is amazing let's let's say you're uh want to do a pov for your artist and he's in a really cool area that you can describe very well you could do this shot to make an additional scene for your music video the bible and these ones are really cool as well like look at that like that is unreal that that is ai actually blows my mind guys you want to go into my media and essentially just wait till it generates. All right, guys, so it ended up failing. I think it's because I made the prompt like way too long. So I definitely recommend you guys make it like about this big. So if I go back here, I can show you guys the prompt for this one here. So you see like it's it's not that big. What I recommend you guys do is you literally crank out a bunch of these. And I think it's like, I think I'm at a time right now where a lot of people are using this. So it's gonna take a long time, especially with like all the Ghibli stuff going on right now with ChatGPT. But I think if you run it overnight or you leave it for a couple of hours, like I did this one 
early today and I left it for like two hours and it came back. So I think you could crank out like 10 of them and then come back to them and then you'll have them for your video. I wish I could show you guys the example, but I'm really running out of time crunch right now. But you guys can clearly see here that it's very capable of creating some really cool stuff. Like this is a very long one here, as you can see. So definitely recommend checking this out for you guys' music videos and for your scenes. If you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like. If you learned something, let me know in the comments down below. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.